Um, so there was another clue that you could have uh, you could have heard here um, about what was going on up here if I hadn't screwed up and and I guess someone uh, needed some first aid recently. Gone and got Mark shot before talking to everyone, yeah. which was that uh, you could talk to the the mom about how. Terry, the dad, who is dead or whatever, um, need with this kind of stuff. Uh, built he the house delicious. custom, oh. <laughs> um, which explains like why there's you know somewhat hidden what rooms and and holes in these walls that power cords can go through and whatnot. Which begs the question: Why? Did he design these into this? Yeah. Holes? Well, is he this planning? is just a bookcase in front of a, a in front of a bathroom door. <laughs> was he planning on a zombie apocalypse turning his family <laughs> into a band of cannibals? I mean, was that a contingency that he planned for? Because if that's true, then damn, it's a shame we lost him in the beginning. Because a guy with a planning horizon. Son of a bitch. I know, it's it's a shame. Mmm, you know what I love? Dinner. Mark. What the hell happened? Oh, uh, Mark, so I'll be back to help you later, but uh, I gotta go finish dinner first. What the hell happened to your legs, man? Don't eat. Uh, these guys are video game cannibals, fiction cannibals. And I hate these kinds of cannibals, because they don't make any sense when you think about them even a little bit. Josh likes the real cannibal. <laughs> Keep it real. Well, it... Oh, save Clementine! Okay, is it sick that this is actually kind of making me hungry? Don't eat that! <laughs> that is sick. Huh? Haven't I been eating in a while? Jesus, man. Did you find something? Yeah, awesome. you saved Clementine. Nice going. Made you a meal. Yeah, yeah, I'm all in favor of troll play. Th man. Yeah, I, I'm all in favor of troll playthrough, but uh, yeah. That's crazy. What the hell? Oh, I'm scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong? <laughs> but not. With you? I don't want to screw up Clementine. I like how everybody's like, no, what? That can't possibly be what's going on. There's apparently some way you can just. You can just goad Larry into munching down. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. I like how he refers to him as some guy and not Mark, your friend who's been here for three years. Yes, <laughs> I thought that was really odd. I wonder if they changed the episode to some degree. Settle down, honey. Because I was surprised I, it was a late edition. You're taught not to waste. How I was raised and how I was anyway, um, he would not have died anyway. That's the bitch. <laughs> back to cannibals for a minute. It they continue to rot till they eat some more. So their plan here is to. to oh, I'm gonna puke. To to just like find survivors and 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 then eat them. That. There's gotta be an easier way to find food than that, okay? I mean, A, there's not a lot of survivors running around anyway. B, they're all heavily armed. It's not called the most dangerous game because... because it was set on a deserted island. It's called the most dangerous game because humans are really hard to kill. And they tend to try and kill you back what? using their tools. Yeah. We're walking out of here. I like how they're all armed at the dinner table and you're not. Don't we We're all have screwed. guns too? I mean, every single person in this yeah. group has been shown having a gun at some point. The the story's a little weird Somebody about who has guns and who something. doesn't. How about instead of saying something, I just do something? How about that, game? There was actually several opportunities here where you could have seized the villain and done some damage. Was there? Yeah. Not in the game. Ow. Red Scarn's talking hypothetical. <laughs> yeah. Mark is <laughs> Mark's doing the work. Oh, hi guys. You want to leave for dinner? So, this, I'm, I'm, this is probably my least favorite of the episodes. Just because it's such... Uh, it's a weird side story. It 
doesn't really have anything to do with the rest of the stuff that happened. It's not very continuous. Yeah. I mean, there's a time skip before it, and there's a time skip after it. And it's just kind of ugly and mean and left a bad taste in my mouth. No pun intended. And it, it, it doesn't make it a lot of sense. Yeah, the, the bad guys are kind of pointlessly evil. Um, and... And it introduced Mark and then killed him off. And it, yeah, this is the weakest of the episodes for me. To be fair, even though I agree that it is probably the weakest, it's it's still pretty riveting entertainment as far as oh yeah, it is. Yeah, it's it's good. It's, and I like it's good. This, like it's, it's saying that, a lot that, that the weakest on one out is good. It's don't give up. We're gonna find. Yeah, a now that we're away from the St. Johns and we're just dealing with the group again, it feels like we've returned to the core of the game. Anything we can pry away. I actually think um, the fourth one is the weakest one, but I can see where you guys are coming from. I think it's telling that the weakest one is still damn good. Really want to attract their attention? Yeah, I want to attract their attention. Yeah, me too. I really like the fourth one. Guess your new girl. All right, Larry, why don't you just scowl that door down? You big hunk of jerk ass, you. Back at the motor lodge, even after I saved your fucking life, and you went out of your before trying to end it. Snap! You must really. I guess yeah, what? What? Oh, what? You're stuck with me. I plan to be around long after you are gone. You went out of your way to be an asshole to me tonight. Uh, Frankly, I was hurt. I thought we were friends. Dad! Open up, goddammit! No. You interrupted no. dinner. Energy to hate. Don't forget, I know who you really are. Come on! Man, this guy's really talking himself into <laughs> an untimely demise right here. Pretty heavy. Think we could heave it through the door? Ah, door's too solid. There's more of us on the way! <laughs> Your dad's not making things any easier for us. Open the fucking dad, door! Dad, stop! God damn it! They're not gonna open the door! You, so the vent covers the obvious solution. Have my family. I know! So obviously I, like I don't how know anyone who didn't them. immediately notice it. I yeah. like how w when you first wake up here, the salt lakes are the first that thing that you see, yeah, you which is kind of fitting because if you if you play the next part right, then it's the last thing that Larry ever sees, and I'm sure that's not an accident. No. We're oh, speaking of which, yeah. are, are, are we? No, we we have to kill him. We're going full Kenny friendship. Remember, oh, full Kenny right, friendship yeah. and. This is, and the most people did try and save Larry. And killing him outright, which is, I grabbed that salt lick and it was like, okay, this guy's a problem and a personal danger to me and Clementine. Give me the salt lick, I'm gonna bash his brains in. The problem, of course, here is, that we're facing is, if he dies, he'll turn, and then we'll have a giant 300 pound zombie in here with no weapons. Which would be bad. There there is a way to do this where he will wake up. Yeah, you've got to put it off as long as. Yeah, I think you've got to put it off as long as possible. Maybe you're right. Like you'd have to fight Kenny all the way. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore. No, I think it's actually if you're about to do it. Oh, okay. Well, like wakes up as in wakes up as a zombie or wakes up as a human. Oh, interesting question. I just assumed. I haven't seen it myself. I've he heard people describe it. And I always assumed he just wait, came wait, wait. back Don't around. It was fine. I, I, I love that scene there now, in retrospect, where Kenny's like, remember what Ben said. Like, Kenny referencing something Ben said, as if it's a serious piece of advice. <laughs> so, so do we help Kenny then? Or, or Lily? Yeah, yeah, or Kenny. Yeah, yeah, yeah Kenny. Kenny. So yeah, what happens if you help Kenny, or what happened when I tried to help Lily, was I tried to resuscitate him, and then like, while I'm doing like the quick time event CPR game mechanic thing, uh, Kenny dropped a salt lick on his head. Yeah. What, what happens if I fail this? Can I just like sit here for forever? Huh. Well, okay. <laughs> this is kind of awkward. Like you're, it looks like you're trying to make them kiss. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like the worst back rub ever. 
Looks like some kind of no. crazy new club <laughs> dance. No! Does he just like Here loot here Kenny. if you don't do it? He yeah. drops it on your head. You know what? You suck at video <laughs> games, <laughs> Lee. You Kill gotta Mary. die. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Kill like I'm waiting. Do, 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 do. I, I wonder if if he does wake up if you wait long enough here. Wow, this is pretty terrible. I didn't do it this way. I, I helped Lily and then, like, Kenny decided to do it on his own. I guess there's really Whoa. no other way to handle this. <laughs> well, I <laughs> guess we should so probably... ridiculous. <laughs> we should probably move this along. There's apparently we got no failure do. state. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> You can't fail at this, apparently. It's, it's like, like when you're messing with someone when you're much stronger than they are in your armor. <laughs> uh, you got uh, your head. Uh, uh, they're they're trying man. to punch you, and you're just holding them. I, I, I would note the, the uh, vignetting of the red de definitely gives you impetus to hit Q as fast as possible. because it Yes, implies it does. Yeah. You're losing. Yes, it implies. Oh, I, I always assumed red means something horrible is going to happen. If you don't do this as much as you wait, can, guys, guys, <laughs> you know, like, silly. guys, wait, you know those animations where, like, if you look at them long enough, you can reverse them. I just managed to turn yes. this into Lily's trying to hold still, and Lee is turning her into a human puppet. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I uh, this is just let's, let's, this is just begging to, to be do. a this is just begging to be an animated GIF. Let, let's with let's go spend caption. the rest of the episode talking about whether it's pronounced GIF or GIF. <laughs> <laughs> choose the internet users, choose GIF. Ooh. So, what's Ow. shocking about if you choose the other choice, hey you don't guys, see Kenny- I just had an idea! <laughs> I'm sorry. We're kinda hungry, right? Don't fucking touch me! <laughs> oh! No, but but if if you choose the other option and you don't help Kenny kill him, you're doing CPR and then you look up at his head to start going back to give him mouth to mouth and just this block comes out of nowhere and crushes his skull and just blood everywhere and you sort of freeze for a second <laughs> and then you look up and Kenny's sitting there going, "Well, someone had to do it." And it's just really weird. It's really shocking yeah. if you, if you don't help Kenny. Why were you and she doing that weird dance for like 20 minutes? It freaked me out! <laughs> something hopeful. Like what? He makes her do it too, just to make her cheer up. How about you, Tony? Those pretend talks Don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. Don't, don't encourage her, Josh. Don't. You found a way out. Well, it's, it, it can be more healthy than eating people, maybe. No, seriously. At least we eating people it. nourishes you. I'm hungry. I am actually really hungry. Seriously. Sorry. You know what goes really good with people Don't meat? Salt. <laughs> <laughs> uh, see, I think we should yeah. make this a twofer. Let's you. just take care of Lily while we're this? while we're at it, and we got them both here together. She's already never pissed off. She's mourning over her father, and you just zonk her on the head too. Although coming up with like a plausible, you be repentant about this. <laughs> you don't know what he wanted. You don't understand. You all understand. I mean, don't understand. Why? I like how it frames him so it looks like his head is a salt lake. <laughs> yes. Rutzkarn, Rutzkarn, yeah. I am outlawing any puns involving Blockhead right now. To get the fuck okay, away. okay. I guess we'll just have to charge Kenny with assault and battery. Oh. Damn it! Damn it! Ah! <laughs> ah! Only one important thing right now. <laughs> See, I was holding that in reserve. I was like, should I? Yeah, I've already done one ridiculous spot in this episode. Then you just had to go and provoke me. It's just you and me. <laughs> don't provoke him. You don't know what he's got it's ready. What just happened? She probably sided with the St. John's against us. Okay, how the fuck do I get the quarter now that I killed Larry? You can just grab it if you didn't kill him. You, gotta you go get in it out his pocket, pocket and you get the quarter. I know. Yeah, yeah and Lily is apparently not really cool with you looting her dead father. Which meant that I enjoyed it and made it last as long as possible. 
Kenny's like, hey man, it's my kill. Do the trick. Do you have a coin? Dude, you're ninjing my loot. Yep, yeah, those oh, look like I guess screws. I guess it's pointless to ask why a small child just happens to have a rock way. on their person. It's it's probably a pebble, not like a rock. Why can't you just <laughs> No, it's like a boulder. She's got a bag of holding, she just never told anybody. But if we're gonna get out of here. Can you leave me alone? I'm busy mourning for my horrible, horrible father. I'll remember him at, that he died as he lived, being a horrible nuisance and bringing out the worst in everyone. I also like the idea that it's like Larry's last horrible bit of being a bad human being. The apocalypse has happened and the world has ended and it's been like that for months. Yet he still carries change on himself just because, you know, money's important. <laughs> it's my money! And if I want to carry it around, that's my business! What if we find a gunball machine? Loot his corpse? Or a video arcade? Do what you have to do. What if so I, I imagine make an important part decision? of the reason why why you guys didn't side with Lily uh, coming up in the big conflict in the next episode is because you killed Larry instead of trying to save. Yes. Him. If you yeah, try to and save Lily, him, it I looks gather, a lot gets worse really for Really difficult. If you kill Larry, you've burned all your bridges with Lily. Some people said, "Oh, she kind of had a point," and I guess it's she's unhinged at this point, which really. I understand this is just, you have to accept this, but I would not travel with her after this happened. I mean, I joke about making this a too far, but it really, it would just be such a risk to continue to be with her. Digging through my pockets, uh, here's some money, uh, this looks like, um, something take some candy, probably taken from a baby, oh, here's some papers. This paper certifies Take the, all the, the that's Lily, right. Take da, all da, the da, coins. Adoption. Da, da, da. Oh, hey, Lily, guess what? mine now, Larry. You bastard. Oh, sweet hard candy. Ah, lemon. Jesus. Anyone else want this? It? No. Yeah. Oh. One more should do it. I like how you turned that screw like three times and it didn't move at all. I like that you're turning it clockwise, which would tighten it. Okay, now I'll put the quarter. But ooh, Georgia State quarter. I need this Wait, one actually. Wait, no. Did they turn it the right way? I actually don't know. It looked like it was the wrong way, but no, it was the right way. I don't to know. Lose. Never mind. For us to fit through. I can do it. I blame the angle. You uh, think you can do this? Little Finding Nemo. I could do it. You think you could do this? We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. You, well, you got your fun. Pokemon trainer hat. You'll be fine. Where are Duck and Katcha at this point? Uh, I think they're being ready to be cooked. So this was a really tense moment where you uh, yes yeah. you send Clementine through the vent and then you hear stuff moving around. You have no idea what's going on out there. You feel you like a huge jerk doing this too. Yes, I think you have yeah, to, but yeah, yeah. It just feels so dangerous. You're like in a center out there. You don't know what's going on, and then she cries and, out. And, oh my and gosh! And the good and part about this out. game is it doesn't overuse this sort of like like it's not like Clementine is constantly running off to places you can't get to and right. get into trouble. Leave me alone. It happens like twice the whole game. Right, but they u they use it sparingly and so it's really effective because it doesn't feel like oh they wanna they wanna yank your chain with Clementine again. It feels like oh this is happening. Crap. Well, not just not just from an emotional standpoint, but also from a mechanical standpoint. It it could have right. easily started feeling like a Metroid style. Oh, a ball shaped thing. I bet I have to turn into a ball and go in there. And it could have felt like <laughs> yeah. oh, a small hole. Clementine needs to be shoved through there to get me something. And they avoid that pretty easily. Watch any Paladin. <laughs>